Hello and welcome fellow gamers to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. And just before Christmas, that was really unexpected, the 5.0 update just came as you can see. Fortunately we're still at our uh, capital vessel, but this update is really, really, really big and huge because the main feature of this update is this is the solar system and the warp jumping. So, as you can see, we're on our capital vessel. So let's steer it a bit, and we're at the research station, which we have just um, took over a couple of. Uh, days ago, and as you can see, I think that's the Ningus over there, just beyond the asteroid field. That's the Omicron, and the distance between the planets is now uh, is now really really big. So that's that's cool. So the n new solar system consists now of eight planets, two moons, and three OIs. The new planets like Alien, Desert, Baron, and Leva, and they are distributed in in different sectors. So you need a capital vessel, a capital vessel, and a warp drive to jump uh, from one planet to another. So let's um, let's leave that and let's make ourselves a brand new capital, uh, not capital vessel. The what drive so that's in here um, so now I'm, now I'm gonna go with the other features uh, added to the game they have added new creatures al two alien bags and two golems swamp and ice and one new variation of the desert worm and the armored golem that you know from your uh, first trailer um, he will defend some POIs the capital vessel uh, can now uh, land on the planet, so that's cool. So let's go over to the capital vessel, and over here we have a warp drive. So let's unlock that uh, in order to build it. And we have it. We have a lambic gear, so that's cool. We're gonna do that. We're gonna make a uh, few of those. So now we can land on the planets. That's cool. And. Mm, added several new asteroid fields example ring around planet so we're gonna go and check those out mm, added possibility possibility to sort a ping and players and the server browser yeah 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 some other um, multiplayer additions as well and now the radar, radar map in space uses a logarithmic scale uh, for faraway objects and added a uh, compass for radar map on planets. As you can see there is a shit ton of uh, drones in this space so that's that's really not good and that what concerns me because of um, my shitty turrets uh, not working. But let's go over here and see all the stuff which uh, has been added to the game. So first of all, we need to make ourselves a warp drive. Yes, we are, and the landing and the landing gear for uh, this capital vessel. Yes, we're gonna install it in just a few in just a few seconds. I don't know how the warp drive works, but um, I think it has something to do with the uh, map. Uh, if you press M, you don't see any more um, the map of the solar system, but over here uh, you have this um, thing, this list of asteroids and oh, Zayn's orbit, the Z orbit planet, <laughs> the Z planet, the M planet, and uh, I I I this orbit. Yeah, so these are gonna be. Oh man, Estus is called the uh, alien outpost, the Ningus orbit trading trading outpost. Oh, that's cool. Oh man, I can't wait to go go there. And new changes and improvements uh, added new logo and tweak the main menu. Yeah, you can see that in the main menu now. Uh, stamina is now also slowly uh, regained while walking. 
that's cool added doc doc uh, info in the HV panel so you can uh, you can uh, dock your uh, hover vessel uh, to your capital vessel when you land it on a planet so that's cool I do really like that anyways uh, what else uh, there are new models for the uh, fridge there are two new landing gears so let's get over here and see new fridges so these are the fridge tier 2 and the new models have been also added to the oxygen stations as you can see right now so the warp drive the warp drive is it done yet yes it is so let's take that and let's take the gear and may let's put the warp drive and the landing landing gear because we gonna need those pretty pretty soon I don't know how big it is oh uh, it's huge it's humongous so let's go up um yeah so this is kind of a bummer but maybe we will be able to go outside and place it outside just for fun alrighty then alrighty then cool <laughs> So this is the warp drive which will allow us to go to mm, to the other planets. Does it have any info? No. I can't do anything with it. Uh, uh, uh. Let's stay on on the capital vessel. So that's cool. It's really, really huge. So these fridges, um, they haven't changed inside. But we might as well go outside and take... Bah, 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 bah look outside and check if we will be able to place those down um, yeah it's gonna be a problem I believe so let's make this and let's um, see if we have some blocks <laughs> let's just make this makeshift landing gear that's two down nope go down go down and place that one here and we're gonna place two on the back of a ship as well like so and the other one over here because I want to take this bad boy to some new planets which we now have I know no, I know it doesn't look that good but you know I don't want to start over the new game uh, considering the fact that I'm going away for this Christmas holiday and I'm recording this ahead of time so that's cool now we have a warp drive we have a landing gear uh, so let's go over to the changes and improvements uh, blah 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 so the new model for the warp drive the better weapons models to all drones they have added better trail effect to resource asteroids and uh, several new POIs uh, added new capacitor capacitor What's this control panel? Oh, it looks re it look it looks really really nice. And as you can see, you can deco with the capacitors. I don't care about those, but you can do those because I'm not really a big fan of creating the decorative stuff. Anyways, what else? And uh, slightly reduced range of SV weapons to make it more challenging to. To conquer a POI, slightly increased speed of alien plasma rockets, and also range of alien terrains. So that's not cool because it's gonna be harder to take over any POIs. Rescaled rocket and plasma turrets for HV, reduced light intensity of work lights, of work lights, tweaked light on drill, filler and repair tool, tweaked flashlight uh, of player 
a bit one wider angle tweaked particle effect when drilling a resource asteroid less particles are dropped and the change name and they have also changed name of aqua fruit to ah ax 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 fruit and remove this from aqua and now it's it only appears on the desert planet so anyways let's hop on this bad boy and let's take it for a spin and let's go to Omicron so how does it work Omicron orbit lock on target Up. Uh, 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 uh. yeah so that's a bummer um, there were some information how to travel between uh, how to travel between orbits so give me a sec I'll be right back and check this out okay guys I'm back and there is an info on the imperialonline.com how to make a uh, warp jump first add a warp drive to CV I did that get into the co cockpit of your capital vessel yep that's the second point CV board power usage info uh, distance to Omicron gravity zero passengers zero rocket launchers ammo 5 did they change that? no they haven't changed that and then select get into the cockpit and open the map so let's open the map and now select the destination from the list on the left and click lock target on the bottom right so let's go to let's go to here to the orbit lock a target if your target planet is already in the field of view a blue rectangle will show up uh, there's an arrow so let's move this bad boy yes Skillan is 2 AU away from us if your tar target planet is already in the field of view a blue rectangle will show up if the target planet if the target planet is out of sight a blue arrow will show up on either side of your screen turn your vessel towards the direction until your target planet get in in sight and shows the targeting re rectangle yeah so we done that move the crosshair of the ship in the center of the blue rectangle make sure you uh, everyone on your CV is sitting in a passenger seat accelerate to at least 50 meters per second and hit K to activate the warp drive yeah cool so K so let's accelerate let's try not to hit those um, uh, uh, where's the speed and press K so let's press K sweet baby Jesus that was cool that was really oh, uh, sorry that was really fantastic so we're on this new planet with the asteroid field around it oh man that is awesome so let's go yep that's the rocket so let's go in I don't care about drones right now I just want to see the new planet it's gonna take a while to land on this planet well we're not gonna land on it but we're gonna go and see how it looks from inside lots of drones around in here so that's a bummer but hey ho no risk no fun so we are now approaching the planet I really do love this warp drive thing come on baby we are going oh and we are here 
Sweet. Power usage 89%. Power left for 15 minutes, so that's not good. As you can see, there is a new radar on the screen. Porek discovered a new resource, Prometheum. Um, unfortunately, you cannot shoot this weapon in here, so that sucks. Man, this planet looks cool. So let's try and land somewhere safe over here. I have discovered the silicon. So, do -do 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 -do. I think I have already landed. Yes, I did. So let's check this planet. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is really high. But I think I won't be able pretty much to get out of here. Cool, that is. Oh, holy mother of drones. Oh, we're gonna go. We're gonna have so much fun with this now. Okay, so let's go to another planet and check it out. Let's fly a bit. Silicon deposit. That's great. The small vessel, fortunately, is still docked inside our capital vessel. Over here. Over here. But let's go to another planet. Let's go up. We're using a shit ton of energy. So we're gonna need another generator. I already have two. So probably we're gonna need additional two and a shit ton of energy as well. So yeah. That's great. Let's go up, up, up. And I'll see you around. Let's go up. Now I want to go with you guys with this. This is really cool. And just a few millimeters, and we're on the orbit. So let's see what else we have in here. So we've been. Where are we? We are here. So let's go to this target. Lock on target. What's this orbit? Yep. So it's on the right. The power usage fortunately went down. Oh, it's really hard to turn this cube. Come on, come on. Where is it? Is it the new planet? No, the Ningus and the Estus are the same, so let's hit the K. Oh no, we need to accelerate. And now we can hit the K. Uh, uh, uh. Yes, and off we go. So there is a drone over here, but we're gonna, we're not gonna bother about him. So I see you around on the planet while when we land. Okay, guys. So we're approaching the 80s. That's what this planet is called. So let's see what's over here. As you can see, the water is green, I believe. That's a bummer that you cannot shoot the uh, orbital weapons in here on the planets, but considering the fact that how much... Satium! Oh, cool! So now Satium is on the planets as well. But, um, yeah, considering the... F oh, look at this sky! It's absolutely beautiful! <laughs> 
considering the fact that how much power does this um, weapons use it wouldn't be advised uh, to use it on the planet because probably they would set it on fire <laughs> but hey ho what can you do anyways let's go down oh, uh, 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 no 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 you need to get a hang of flying your capital vessel around the planets oh man it's humongous so yeah as you can see you really need to get a hang of it to land this huge huge ship on the surface okay so this is another planet what I wanted to actually see because I've just read it that there are some turrets defensive turrets for the capital vessel because if you cannot shoot those in here you would be like um, a sitting duck for all the drones but hopefully my turrets will defend the CV if necessary okay so let's go to another planet right now we've been to here we haven't been over here so let's look on that and I'd see you around on on Masperen orbit uh, welcome back guys and we're here at the Masperon I've just discovered the Saskosium deposit so let's go through the map so this is the PvP mode and whoa, 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 I can already hear some creatures around here I believe that's the uh, it looks like Oh, 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 no, 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 the landing isn't really great, so as you can see, I think that's the desert, the desert type planet, because of the alien tones, what creatures, there's a Mr. Blub, Let's see what else is in here. I thought I heard the flower. Oh, oh look, 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 look. Ah, ah, oh. This is the new bag. One of the new two new bags. It is really huge. Yeah, cool. I like that. I really, really do enjoy going through all those planets and I can't wait. There's a drone and this has costume, another deposit. I really do enjoy going through all those new features included with this update. Oh man, this is really fantastic. This game now starts to look like um, really really enjoyable piece of craft and probably in the next episode in the future I don't know when, when it's gonna happen but we can start over a new world and we're gonna go and we're gonna go through every single one of the planets check them out and see what is really about them. So we've been to Aqua, Ningus, or Omicron. We haven't been to the trading post. Uh, we've been to uh, Skilon, 80s. So the Zines. So let's lock on that and let's get going to there. Not giving a crap about the drones around here. 
Come on, where is it? Where is it? Uh, 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 it's pretty close actually, but you won't get on your regular engines there. So let's get there. Oh man, I do love the sound of that. Warp drive. So I think I'm gonna see you uh, back on the uh, surface of this planet. So stay tuned. Okay guys, so we're just approaching the Zines planet, the new planet, it looks really... Oh, look at this pink, pink sky, my daughter would love it, because from what I have now known is that the pink is the most beautiful color of them all. So there's a magnesium deposit, this looks more flattish, this looks like a more flattish a planet with a shit ton of magnesium, which is actually good for uh, weapons. So that is really cool. Another, another uh, desert planet. So let's go through here. Any more? Any new creatures around? Wow! Hello, Mr. Two Foot. Oh, the spider, spider thing, scorpion thing. And there's a, there are drones. Well, actually, one of them scouting the area. There is another one. Now the drones are flying over the deposits. This is an, another cool area, another cool planet. So what I want to do now is go to this uh, trading post where we're gonna finish off this episode because this is really amazing and opens up a whole bunch of new opportunities for us to uh, to play and to uh, see what's on these planets, if there are any new POIs, how do they look, and I can't wait to find out every single one of those. So let's go to the trading post, and as you can see flying is not that easy. Let's go with the K. No, you need to fly towards the target. Okay. So let's go. Okay. So where is it? Where is the trading post? I think that's the research station. That's the trading post nowadays. Because I believe we're pretty close to the Omicron as well, and this this really looks like um, docked no distance. So as you can see, there are two homes, home icons. I'm not quite sure where am I now, but that's no biggie. Let's go over there and see what's in here. This is pretty big asteroid field. This looks like an Ingus to the left. But I think there is a st some station over there. Try not to heal. Thermika station. Oh, 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 hello there. Hello there, sir. Asteroid, asteroid. I, I don't see any bad boys around here. I don't know if it's gonna be hostile or not. So let's don't, 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 don
and now let's see how it looks this is the new trading station so there is a cannon over here there is a cannon over there can I dock on it the glass panels the control panels are up there and I think on the left I saw I saw the other station um, alien outpost no I don't think that's gonna be it there's the aqua I believe so let's get closer and see if those turrets will go host hostile or on us no they are not can I dock somewhere I think that's the entrance Migotsu Orbital Hub oh sweet baby Jesus I like that name just a two kilometers away so that's not far Oh nice! Oh my! Oh my! Mikotsu Orbital Hub. Hello! Hello there! Oh man, this is so cool! This is really impressive! Can I fly in? Will I fit in there? Probably not. Nope. There are some cannons. So we, I think we should stay away. So yes guys, so cool. This, is, this has been a longer video than usual. But you know me. You will get uh, every single information about the new update which just came out and this is really cool so we're gonna wrap it up in here so we're gonna wrap it up in here and uh, if you liked the video hit the like button down below and leave the comments in the comment section down below as you can see I'm running low I'm running low on energy because of that planetary landings and yes this update is really really impressive and um, I've planned <laughs> some other Christmas special episode but the Empyrean guys uh, did it for me mm, I wanted to do something else but um, yeah that's what you're gonna get for the Christmas special the Christmas special 5.0 update uh, so thanks for watching and again I wish you a very Merry Christmas uh, have a good time spend it with your family uh, I hope you're gonna get a, a nice amount of uh, presents as well and again Merry Merry Christmas and Vesel Świąt and I see you and I hope I see you around in the next episode take care then bye bye now this was Borek logging off